What's up, Magic the Rescuing fans? In that awesome, awesome, awesome haul we got from Craigslist that was free, there were quite a few collector boosters in the mix. So we're going to open up the Commander Legends. I'm trying to complete an etched foil set uh, that's going to go up for sale on eBay, as well as our Mercari. You can check out the links below for any of the singles that you might see on these videos. They are available for purchase there. Uh, if you see something that's not listed, you can always shoot me a message that says, hey, I'm interested in this card and we can work something out and we'll make a listing for you. Um, but that is one of the main vessels and vehicles about how we raise money for Magic the Rescuing and the future of our awesome rescue ranch for Great Danes and farm animals. Um, so we're going to get into this Commander Legends. We're going to hopefully complete the etched foil set. And who knows, maybe we will pull one of the gorgeous foil jeweled lotuses. I mean, even the regular uh, extended art would be pretty sweet. Um, there are also quite a few other cards in this set that hold great value, especially in the full art foils. So here we go. We're going to get straight into it. And we are going to oh, give the Niffler a little pat. Let him sniff that. You can smell anything in there? That's good. And then, of course, the Money Toad. we got to give him a pat. And now we're going to get right into it. We are primed and ready to go. All right, here we go. And they do have, as you can see, a little bit of pringling going on here. So um, not something that you can't fix, especially when it's not that, that extreme, but still uh, kind of crazy that this kind of set, um, that they haven't corrected something like that, especially since the etched foils are phenomenal. Starting off beautifully with a full art foil Arcane Signet. Um, that's a very good start. Uh, uncommon full art foil. We're going to put it down there. A preordained full art foil. That's also a very good one. Um, so we'll put that there. And we're going to make some piles here because that's what Commander Legends is all about. Multiple types of piles that you're going to need. All right. To your bear claw. Dargo the Shipwrecker. We got a full uh, foil rare flamekin herald very nice full art generous gift non-foil but still cool the sweet gum recluse and starting out with our ghost of ramirez di pietro for our first etched queen marchesa is actually one that i need so now we are down to two um that's pretty awesome pulling the queen very nice, and a Krark the Thumbless following up. Very nice etched foil uh, pulls there with a treasure token that turns into a rock. All right, well, that's a good start. Um, the Arcane Signet preordains. You know, those, are, those are worth a few bucks for sure. And then Queen Marchessa, we needed that etched foil for our set. We are down to two. One of them is an uncommon, actually. So one of them is an uncommon that we still need, which is kind of strange. Um, we've opened enough Commander Legends to think that we might have one, but we do not. All right, going through these commons pretty quickly. Uh, and the uncommons. The least reverent medium. Kedis, Emberclaw Familiar. Very nice foil, a Chroma's Will. That's a decent card that's been on the rise recently. So that's a nice pull there. Kumbaj Witches there for a full art uncommon. An Elvish Dreadlord. Full art rare. I haven't seen many of him. I don't think he's got too much value. We got Numa, the Jiraga Chieftain for our first etched foil. Marith, Will of the Wild. Very cool etched foil there for the mythic one. And an Akroma, double mythic there. Akroma Vision of Ixidor. That's a great pack, too. We're, we're pulling the great packs right now. This is already sweet. These are random packs, by the way. These did not come out of a box. These are loose packs that could have come from random searched boxes or, you know, any manner of shenanigans that might happen when you find loose packs. Always beware uh, if you're buying loose packs online. There are some evil folks out there that don't do the right thing, and they search their packs. There's a foil 
full art generous gift. That's nice. Put him up there. Armix, the filigree thrasher. Gormuldrock, amphenologist. Very nice foil mythic commander's plate. That's a sweet card. Very nice pull there. Full art fact or fiction. And a full art flamekin herald. And then we got the radiant Sarah Archangel for an uncommon etched. Very nice mythic Moldroth of the Grave Tide. This is a great card too. Um, you can play a land and cast a permanent spell of each permanent type from your graveyard. Uh, he's a crazy self mill commander. Very nice. And then Bell Borka, Spectral Sergeant. Also very nice. Oh, and an upside down elf warrior turns into a cop copy. I thought that was maybe a misprint. That would have been kind of cool. Uh, flipped on its flipped on the long edge. All right. Well, we're definitely getting some sweet cards. Nothing too crazy yet. None of the big dogs. Um, but we still have plenty to go here. All right. Foil full art acidic slime. I don't think that that has too much value. We'll put them to the side there. Breaches, the Brazen Plunderer. He's cool. Rav, Master Smith. Very nice. Foil spectator seating. These multiplayer lands are pretty awesome. Another Acidic Slime. A Full Art Necrotic Hex. We got ourselves a Tuya Bear Claw etched foil. Zur the Enchanter etched foil. Very nice mythic one there. And Quain. Iterant Meddler. When I first saw this card spoiled, I was like, man, that's an awesome looking card. Nothing like a bunny rabbit wizard. Very cool. Elf Warrior into a copy. Lots of Elf Warrior copy tokens going on here. I split it into stacks as I always do. I can't help myself. It's got to be organized into stacks. Is that another copy token there? There's another copy token on the back there. Very weird. What? Man, I don't think I've seen too many of this card. Dispeller's Capsule. It's cool looking. Sky Diamond. Very nice foil diamond there. Foil Kumbage, which is from the Seb McKinnon artwork, which, I mean, definitely the best Kumbage witches that you can get. Tuya Bear Claw again. Elegeth Crossroads Augur. Oh man, that's nice. Full art foil rings of bright hearth. You know, even if these are searched, we're still getting some pretty phenomenal pulls. We'll put that. Do we have? I don't think we have any full art foil rares yet. So that's the first one. Burnished heart and a laboratory drudge. Tago, goblin weaponsmith. Carador, Ghost Chieftain, he's super cool. Centaur Spirit, beautiful etched foil. And another, Krark the Thumbless. He's probably one of the better fo etched foil rares. Spirit and, and a copy instead of Elf Warrior and a copy this time. All right, well, still waiting for the big hits. That Rings of Brighthearth Bright Heart is very good, though. I don't know what the value is on it off the top of my head. It's not one of the top five, but it is very good. I love the Golgari Elf uh, push. I think it's very cool over this set. And then Kaldheim, Pride of the Perfect there. There's another Krark the Thumbless, but it's the regular version for a foil rare. Arshelos, Lagoon Mystic, Body of Knowledge. We're tripling up on the rares here. Very nice full art Kadama's Reach. Full Art Command Beacon. Very nice card there. Brineland the Moon Kraken. For our etched foil. Kaidel, Chosen of Crufix. Very nice. With Zara, Renegade Recruiter. And then another upside down token. Treasure into a zombie. Alright, well. So far, only one of the three that we need has appeared in the etched foil land. Pretty sure that Merith Will of the Wild was not one that I needed, but I could be mistaken. 
All right. Here we go. Alaru, Solemn Ritualist, Halana, Kessig Ranger. We got a Nightshade Harvester. So have not seen a lot of that card. That's kind of cool. Very nice. Full art, Soul Ring. Can never have enough Soul <laughs> Rings. There we go. The first Mega. It's not foil, but it's still amazing. Vampiric Tutor, Full Art, Mythic. Very nice. Oh, man, that's a great pull right there. I actually think that one of the first boxes that I opened of Commander Legends had the Vampiric Tutor full art in it. Very nice. We got Kanji, Sky Warden, Etched Foil, Maelstrom Wanderer, decent for the Mythic slot there, and then Liesa, Shroud of Dusk for our rare Etched Foil. Treasure Token into a Zombie. Well, that's our first big hit, the Vampiric Tutor. Tutors. You can't ever have enough of them in Commander, that's for sure. Every single kind of tutor you can have, you want it in your deck. Um, I did, however, hear that people, uh, there is a, the, like a sect of people out there that do not like or ban tutors from their uh, playgroups, which is kind of weird. All right, we got the Port Razor. Oh, that's a full art foil mythic. Very nice. Not the one we're looking for, but we will take it. Terramorphic Expanse, a Blade Griff prototype, and we've got Keskit, Timna the Weaver. That's one of the top three etched foils. Very nice to get that card, and another Acroma Vision of Ixidor, double mythic etched foil. Man, this is this is awesome with a Golem token, and we're getting ready to move into the. Second stack, the middle stack, and we're already, we're going crazy here. We've got lots of value. Pull the Vampiric Tutor, Foil, Full Art, Rings of Bright Hearth. All right, let's continue this trend, that's for sure. All right, here we go. Radiant Sarah Archangel, very nice. Ghost of Ramirez, Di Pietro. Another Foil, Acroma's Will, very nice. Kadama's Reach for the Full Art Uncommon. Sakashima's Will for the Full Art Rare. We've got Tormod, the Desecrator. Kaidel, Chosen of Crufix for our Mythic. Oh, very nice. Full Art Foil. Tevish Zat, Doom of Fools. Beautiful, beautiful Planeswalker Full Art Foil. Mythic, very nice. Salamander, Warrior, and a Monarch token. Man, we are... We are getting all but the really, really crazy here. I mean, we are slowly and steadily increasing the value of this... Uh, of these pulls. And, you know, if we get one of those crazy ones, we're just gonna... It's gonna get taken over the edge. Thought Vessel is a very nice, uncommon foil. I will put that with these full arts up here. because That's where it belongs. Opal Palace... Also a very cool one, just not a lot of value. We got Hamza, Guardian of Erishin. Another Tevish Sat. This is the regular version. Foil Mythic. Very nice. Full Art Foil, Armored Sky Hunter. That's a great looking card. Wow, we are just killing it here. Kumbaj Witches. Oh, man! Full art hole breacher, not the foil, but a full art hole breacher. The foil would be $200, uh, but this is, I think, probably like 50 or 60 bucks. Very nice full art hole breacher. Man, we are killing it today with these pulls. Arden, Brago, Eter King Eternal, very nice. He's a great mythic legendary creature. And then Jared. Jared. Like Subway Jared or Jared Jewelers. He's the true heir, though. We, we just, you know, that's... We gotta make sure everybody knows. Soldier token into a copy token. We've got plenty of packs left, ladies and gentlemen. We are already Hole Breacher, Vampiric Tutor, Soul Rings. You name it, we've got it. We haven't seen Sakashima show its thousand faces yet, but who knows? I mean, we've got so many packs left to pull here. Beautiful, full art foil, thought vessel. 
We are just racking it up here. This is amazing. Armix Filigree Thrasher. Jury. Another full art foil armored Sky Hunter. I hope that's got some value. I mean, probably doesn't, but still, it's cool to get a foil full art version of it. Acidic Slime. What is with the armored Sky Hunters? There's a non foil full art version. We've got Slurk. Zedru the Great Hearted, one of my favorite etched foils. I love the Minotaur Monk, he's cool. Very nice. Followed by Amareth the Lustrous. Horror and Dragon. Ooh, nice dragon token. Love a good dragon token in my life. All right, well, we are moving along here. Looks like we're about the halfway point. We're halfway through the middle stack, which means we're halfway through the, the entire deal here. And we have pulled some amazing stuff. Tuya Bearclaw. Another Dargo. Laboratory Drudge for our rare foil. Very nice. Swords to Plowshares. Not the foil. Still very cool. And then a Court of Ambition. I'm going to put that there. I think it's got some value to it. Court of Ambition Full Art. The Prismatic Piper Etched Foil. Ishai Ojitai Dragon Speaker for our Mythic. Followed by Livio Oathsworn Sentinel. Treasure and an Angel. Man. We are doing better. We're doing better with these loose packs than we did with the past like three box openings that we did, which is pretty crazy. Maybe somebody put these aside. They were like, "Oh, these are going to be really good. Let me put them to the side." We got the Tamir Battle Rage there for a full art common foil. I'm knocking stuff over here. Ragrock, son of Raga, the first appearance. We like him. He's cool. And then I just recently looked at actual the actual Raga card. I think it's from Legends. It's pretty crazy looking. I like it. It's definitely spiking lately. I think it's a reserve list card, as all reserve list cards are going crazy. Brynlin the Moon Kraken. Sweet Gum Recluse for the spider. Coiling Oracle. Full art common. Court of Cunning. Full art rare. Very nice. And we've got Hamza. Another Queen Marchessa. Just doubled up on a etched foil that we need. Queen Marchessa. And then we've got Bell Borka, Spectral Sergeant. That, that's what happens, though, when you have loose packs like this. You can double up on stuff because, obviously, it's not from the same box. Probably not, maybe not even from the same case. So, you're going to double up. That means that you technically could pull two full art foil jeweled lotuses. You never know. All right, here we go. Return to Dust, full art foil. I like this card, even though it doesn't have a lot of value. Still very cool to get a full art foil one. I will put it here, though, just in case. That Timur Battle Rage again. Kesket, the Flesh Sculptor. Breaches, Brazen Plunderer. Another Armored Sky Hunter, this time the regular version in foil. Got lots of Armored Sky Hunters. If you're looking for one, make sure you send me a message. All right, we got a Rakshasa... Debaser for our full art there. Kedis, Emberclaw Familiar. Very cool. Bruce Tarl, Boorish Herder. Very cool. And Nostro, Voice of the Crags. Treasure and a Monarch. Man. Tons of Commander Legends. Tons of value. Heard... Wicked rumors that whatever is out there is out there, and that's the last of it. So if you need to get your hands on some, you need better get it now before it goes to $500 a box. Beautiful foil arcane signet. We'll put that to the side there. Another full art foil returned to dust. I like it. Radiant Sarah Archangel. Beautiful foil. That's a great looking foil. Pretty rare in this set for the regular foils to be good, uh, of good quality, but hey, what do you know? All right, we got to reshape the earth for a mythic foil. Very nice. Myriad landscape for a full art uncommon. Kamal's will for a rare full art. Glacian power stone engineer. Another Marith will of the wild elemental beast. 
And never in all. Urborg Tyrant. It's worth a few bucks. Golem in a copy. Middle stack. Just about done. And we're going to move on to our final left-hand stack and see. Is that where the Jeweled Lotus lies? We're going to find out. Are we going to get one? We've been searching for one for months. Prava of the Steel Legion. Sweet Gum Recluse. Full art. Oh, that's a foil. Oh, that's kind of cool. Uh, Counterspell. Full art. Very nice. Another full art hole breacher. That's the kind of duplication we're looking for. Very nice. That's phenomenal. Alaru, Solemn Ritualist. Akiri, Line Slinger for our Mythic. And another Nostro, Voice of the Crags, with a soldier and a copy. And we are moving on to the left-hand stack, the last stack. Here we go, moving into it. Two full art hull breachers and one full art vampiric tutor. Those are our major hits today so far. Way better again than what we've gotten in the past with the with the full boxes. So that's definitely kind of weird. All right, we got a Dawn Glade Regent full art foil. Very nice. That's a gorgeous looking card. Sweet. I'll go here. Coiling Oracle. Soulfire Eruption for a Mythic Full Art. Galanra, Collar of Wirewood. Najila, the Blade Blossom. And very nice. Full Art Foil Jessica Thrice Reborn Mythic Planeswalker. And we've got both the Tevish Zat and Jessica now. Very nice pulls. And we are... Just rolling through here with some crazy value. Come on, we just need one full art foil of a whole breacher or a vampiric tutor or... Uh, I don't even want to say the other two. But we can do it. The Jeweled Lotus or the Mana Drain. Terramorphic Expanse, full art foil, very nice. Anara, Wolved Familiar. Elena, Kessig Trapper. A nice little foil Court of Bounty. I love the artwork on this card. Very nice. Swift Foot Boots for the full art. Another great card. Awesome, uncommon. Slash the Ranks. We got Slurk. Ikra Shadiki, the Usurper. Say that ten times fast. A little Naga Wizard action going on. Gore Muldrock, Amphimologist. Treasure and a rock. We're down to, let's see, we got six packs left, ladies and gentlemen. Six packs left. We are doing a phenomenal job on value here. We got one of the three that I need in the etched foils. Yet to hit the big dog. That's a very nice full art foil. Boros Charm. That's got some value to it. It's throwing cards all over the place again. Very nice card there. Galanra. Armix. Ember Wild Captain. Full art foil rare there. Very nice. Victimize. Court of Ire for the full art rare. We got a Thalise. Tana the Blood Sour. And Zara, Renegade Recruiter, with an upside-down golem and zombie. All right, five packs left. This is the countdown. Are we saving the best for last? Can we pull the big dogs? Will we have that kind of luck? A beautiful foil full art soul ring. That is very nice. And just adds to our already pretty insane value. Kanji, Essior, Magus of the Order, full art foil. I think I've pulled one of these yet. That's really nice. Another Swift Foot, <laughs> another Swift Foot boots, full art, very nice. A Wheel of Misfortune, full art rare. Rogrok, son of Raga. I think that's the best uh, uncommon etched foil that you can get. Very nice. We'll actually put him in the rare slot. Ikra Shadiki again, the Usurper. And Averna, the Chaos Bloom. The upside down Elf Warrior. Cop copy token. Four packs left. It's coming down to it. Man, oh man. 
What are we going to get? Arcane Denial, Full Art Foil Common. Another Rogrok, Son of Raga. Brynlin, the Moon Kraken. Another Armored Sky Hunter Foil. Beautiful Counterspell, Full Art. Very nice. Ooh, that's our first one of those. Uh, that is a very nice Rejuvenating Springs, Full Art. Very good. That's a great card to pull. Elena Kessig Trapper. Nekisar, the Mind Razor. Crazy zombie wizard. I don't know why they didn't call him a lich, because that's what he is. And then another Jessica Thrice Reborn Full Art Foil. Mythic Planeswalker. That's two of those now. It's kind of crazy. All right, three packs left. Man, we've got to be saving the best for last here. We've yet to see a Mana Drain or a Jeweled Lotus. Kind of crazy, you know, uh, oper what was it? Opportunity Agent, or I forget what that one's called. That other rare card that's got good value in it. All right, Coercive Recruiter for a full art foil rare. Factor Fiction, Court of Grace for a full art rare. Armix Familiar, Ramos the Dragon Engine. Very nice. I do love this card. I need to build a Ramos commander deck that would be fun and another that's three now three etched foil acroma vision of ixidors again sneaky 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 good value in this lots of very good duplication we got two packs left ladies and gentlemen i am on the edge of my seat here full art foil kadama's reach not a bad start to this pack Emoti, Alaru, we got an Immaculate Magistrate Foil, another Full Art Swift Foot Boots, an Immaculate Magistrate Full Art Rare, we've got a Thalese Reverent Medium, Mold, another Moldrotha, the Grave Tide Etched Foil Mythic, and another Jared. Alright, one pack left, ladies and gentlemen. Did we save the best for last? Will we get one of the big hits in this pack? All right, here we go. Fleshbag Marauder for our foil full art common. A Rumi of the Dead Tide. Galanra, Caller of Wirewood. We've got a foil rare body of knowledge. Here we go. Here it is. Full art generous gift. Full art vault of champions. I believe that that's going to be our last one. Yep. That's a very good card to pull. Very good full art rare. Alaru, solemn ritualist. Prosh, sky raider of Kerr. And our final... Etched foil is going to be Kulfinor, the last U. Man, I can't wait to tally all this up. I think it's going to be phenomenal. None of the really, really big ones in foil anyway, but still an amazing, amazing pull here. Very nice. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Check out the details below on how to support Magic the Rescuing. Follow us on Instagram, at Magic the Rescuing. And if you like it, like it. And if you love it, subscribe.